What is up ladies and G's, D1 Snipes here and today what we're talking about is Search and Destroy on Solar. Uh, we are back. I am sorry for about the week delay that we had there. Uh, Going to be back on these uh, discussions and game type tips and tricks. All kinds of good shit for you guys coming soon. Uh, today we're going to go over the defensive side of things. How do I don't have a class? I don't know. Search and destroy. Um, what we're going to be talking about first is... Um, Watching the B-side, B-side, uh, I like to stack it unless you can predict that they're going A for sure. Um, and the rotations are pretty easy from B, but I'll explain. Uh, this first guy is going to be your top guy. Uh, this class is definitely not what you want. I usually run overclock. You can make this jump with overclock, I guess. I like to, I like to peek this before I jump up. Uh, so if you're right here, uh, make sure that they're not rushing or anything. Then pop up. Uh, this is a great thing for cover. Uh, it's super easy to trade, especially on defense, if you have two good guys that uh, have good chemistry with each other. Um, basically what this um, second story guy is watching is just the jump up, uh, snipers up top anything that may be in the back watching the flank but you're just staying alive here you do not want to get picked up here uh, if you can't kill him uh, maybe the guy on the bottom can get uh, pick up the kill you just want to stay alive up here this is super easy rotations like I said uh, if you call out a you and your sniper need to work that out um, and just you need to watch the middle right here uh, if you figure out they're going a and they're over there um, you can watch the middle push uh, you can watch them trying to flank your guys that are watching A and staying alive over there. But this is a pretty easy job. This guy has got to be a good listener. Um, got to have some good gun skill up top to win those gunfights if they are pushing B. Um, but your main job is just to keep them off the bomb over there and um, let your guys uh, work picks. Great boy. Okay, for your second guy that uh, you want to stack B with, <clears throat> this guy is going to be running. Uh, he can be running sub. I'm just throwing it for speed's sake over here. But I like to go bottom over here or uh, right here if they rush. Um, your top guy will be able to call out the rush. But this is a pretty good, pretty good spot to just stay alive if they do rush the bomb maybe. Um, I like to get in this building because you can trade kills off the top of there pretty easily uh, if a guy does rush. Um, and you, your main job is just, like I said, staying alive over here. You guys, um, they have to push you in order to put this bomb down. So they either have to make a flank really quick, uh, which your middle guy will be watching. Uh, they have to make a quick flank, or they have to flood this side. So you guys just need to stay alive on B side and let your A guys work the flank. And that's how you guys are going to, the best way to defend the B bomb is. Um, just staying alive in this window right here, trying to get a pick. Uh, don't be too aggressive with this spot. Like I said, your main job is to stay alive. The other two guys on the flank's job is to get picks. Um, just laying down in here. Uh, if you can get here, this is a great spot to watch the full flank from. It's just sitting right here. Maybe if they end up going A, and then maybe they rotate back after you guys get a pick or two and go B, this is a great spot to pick that up from. And then as far as your rotation go, that's what it should be. It's just watching the full flank and letting your top guy jump back to the middle. Great job. Get ready for the defend the objective. Um, what you're gonna do for your middle guy here is uh, your best sniper, obviously. Um, this guy can watch a couple different places. Um, but the best place to do it is from back here. Uh, some people like going up here and trying to snipe the A push. Uh, you can do this to get a first pick um, if you're super aggressive, but a lot of people will send a guy middle and kind of double this up so they'll have a guy over by this van. They like to head glitch that. I mean, you can get people rushing A very quickly if you get here, but the risk is uh, that you risk a guy going middle and trying to kill you from there or maybe even through the pipe. Uh, so basically, what I recommend, depending on what you want to do, is to call out this rush and then call out a middle guy, uh, but you're trying not to get picked here. Uh, just remember you're on defense, they have to come to you. Um, one popular spot that I like is just kind of right here, uh, so you don't get picked from glass wall. But you can still watch the middle, the pipe, 
Uh, this just allows for you to keep the middle uh, locked down or at least make those call outs and rotate back. Uh, if they don't end up pushing this way, uh, what you need to do is be sitting right here and watching middle and keeping the uh, any guys that are trying to flank off your guys on B side. And if they do push A, uh, this is, I mean, obviously a good flanking spot. You want to just keep them out of the middle if they're going A and let probably one of your best players work uh, the A side by themselves. All right, so for your right side guy, uh, this can, I like to run overkill if you're gonna run this side. Um, but a pretty easy way to watch this is from like right here. Uh, you can push up, um, you can lay down right here. Um, but your main job is, especially on this map, I know I keep saying this, but I, it, I can't say it enough, especially for this map, is just staying alive. If you see them pushing here, um, most times if you're gonna push on this map you're gonna flood that side with three guys just as quickly as possible get that kill and get that plant because it's so it's kinda hard for the other team to rotate but it's also very difficult if the other team just stays alive you get trapped on offense very very easily and we'll go over that um, why that is on the offensive videos but just watching um, them pushing up here and pushing down there uh, this is basically your main job if you want to get aggressive with it and you're confident and you, th you think that they're going B most of the time uh, you can try pushing up here watching a full flank they're just sitting in this corner is a pretty good spot um, but all you're doing is just watching their full flank uh, because more than likely they're going B and then if they do go B a pretty good spot to pick a guy off from is just sitting top class and watching the middle watching the uh, bottom tunnel but like I said <clears throat> defense is pretty simple here guys all you got to do well, is sit coach. back stay alive um, work those reason. picks as always use teamworks uh, teamworks teamwork uh, rotate back help your teammates communicate all those good things will help you win search and destroys thank you guys for watching I'll catch you guys on um, what will be a longer video for offense as always I'll talk to you guys later peace